My name is Brandon Norwood. I am from Trenton, New Jersey. I currently reside in Harlem, New York, live in the towers, studying film. I feel as if for the amount of money I pay to live here it is not even worth it. Honestly, $800 a month to live in a box, you know? I mean, as much as they repair and a lot of stuff gets broken as they keep going along the way, I mean, the turnstile downstairs is broken. So now people only have one entrance and exit to go in and out of. Uh, they doing carpet. I don't know why they putting in carpet. It seems like it's a waste of money, to be honest with you. Washer and dryers break a lot, you know, and we got to use cards. We have to pay like 20 bucks and use these cards and refill the cards with money. And sometimes the dryers won't dry your clothes because they're broken. Sometimes the door, you know, won't shut. It's kind of ridiculous. I'm on grants and loans. I don't have money, you know what I mean? I'm just a working class kid like everybody else. Honestly, I'm being straight honest, I think it's a trick. It was all a big trick, you know what I mean? Like, a film program here, yeah, it's rewarding, but like I feel like I was getting a lot more when I was going to the community college back home. You know, the equipment and everything was on point. There was like, I had a job with the film department, you know what I mean, working on this TV show. I made my own movie there. They did, they like, it was pretty much, you know, an open door. Like, it's like, yeah, it seems like you try to get some, like a little bit of help. Either A, they don't know what they're doing, or B, they don't care. So, and as for the towers, be honest, you know what I mean? Cause, you know, it makes it look all nice. Like they have these pictures in the brochures, uh, you know, the lounge areas and stuff. And then you look, you get to what you actually get and you're like, wow, people of an older age got to suffer because of the young kids, you know, don't have to be that way. Don't have to scrounge up some money to please fix the elevator in Shepherd Hall. Cause you know, that's a death trap waiting to happen. And nobody deserves that, to die in that little small box that pops up and down. Second of all, please invest in some equipment. Just invest in some equipment and just, you know, keep an eye out for the students too, the students' interest, because, you know, a lot of us students got a lot to say. And some of us say it, but you ain't trying to hear it. So have an open ear.